Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. For those of you that are new here, hello. My name is Isla, and for my returning viewers, it's been a while, huh? Um, I just took a little break because life was just so busy, like in a good way. Um, so I budgeted off camera and um, did my saving scratch off off camera as well. And considering it's been a week since I got paid, I did some spending, so I went and unstuffed digitally um, before I actually took out the money to film this video. Um, so with that being said, let's get started. Um, for today's video, we are stuffing $532, so let's get right to it. So I'm really excited to film this video. I was honestly like debating whether or not I should actually just go ahead and skip this one, but I really wanted to show you guys my new trackers and my new envelopes and some new challenges. So let's get to it. 100, 200. I feel nervous again filming, it's weird. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. No 50s this time. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. 5, 10, 15. 25, 35, 45, 55, 65. Oops. 65, and then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Plus 7. Perfect. $532. So let me double check that my camera's recording because I'm not about to make a rookie mistake and let this shut off on me. So one second. Okay, my cheat sheet's right here off camera, so let's get started. Um, look at how thick my envelope is, and it's not because it's full of money, it's because there's more envelopes in here. Okay, so housing. Housing gets $200. Let me just do a little bit of magic. Okay, 200. There you go. And then gas. Gas has nothing, and we're going to add $5. I already gassed up for the week, and um, that cost me $80. How fun. Groceries. Groceries get $60. Two, four, six. Again, nothing in there. Um, everything that I use will be pinned down below. Um, the trackers are from Eileen, um, I'll link her Etsy, Etsy shop, um, Belladonna Budgets is, um, the creator of my envelopes, <laughs> and speaking of, this is one of the new ones that I ordered and it's eating out, I decided to split entertainment and eating out, um, eating out is obviously self-explainable, self-explanatory <laughs> grammar. Or vocabulary and entertainment it's gonna be like date night so eating out we'll get $40 20 40 again empty so frustrating but it is what it is okay and entertainment gets $30 there you go um, personal get 17. It's an odd number, but you'll see why. There's nothing in there for now. Hopefully, I won't be using this at all this week. Our savings gets $10, and thankfully, there's some in here. So there's, oops. 120, 30, 40. 55, 56, 57, 58, 158. Perfect. 
They're still so brand new, it's hard to put stuff in here. Education, she gets $5. So there it is, 10, 20, five, six, seven, eight, twenty dollars in here. Um, I recently bought a planner. Um, I will probably do a little haul once everything that I purchased will um, be shipped to my apartment. Um, and uh, this is a new envelope as well. It's health. Um, for my previous viewers, you guys know that I've created my own envelopes for health, but I wanted it to be part of my um, binder that's important for me to stuff, so I decided to create one for them as well, or order one at least. Um, so health, health gets, I'm blanking, <laughs> I'm looking at my cheat sheet right now actually, health gets $5, so there's 15 in total in here. Okay, next is self-care again. I ordered it. Um, self-care gets $5, so 15 in total. All right, so household, another one that I moved from my um, envelopes to an actual cash stuffing envelope. Um, and household gets $5, so there's $10 in total. Oops. Okay, and then <laughs> I wasn't joking when I said I wanted a alcohol envelope. Um, instead of naming it blatantly alcohol, I decided to um, call it aperitifs and digestifs. And these are French words for basically aperitifs are um, drinks that are you drink before you eat and digestives are drinks that you drink after you eat. So I thought it was pretty creative. <laughs> and aperitifs and digestives aren't getting, oh, it is getting $5. Um, if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, I am doing a sober June, so this won't be touched till next week. Or no, two weeks. Um, and then last but not least, one of my newer envelopes is coffee. And um, this is kind of a mix of me purchasing coffee and purchasing coffee beans. Um, I love making my own coffee and I'm a huge fan of the French press. So coffee beans are super expensive and I like buying in bulk. So I decided to start saving for it as well. Um, and coffee gets nothing at the moment because I still have a five pound bag in my pantry and that should last me another two weeks and then Isla doesn't get anything because I used to put my education money in here and that will change soon enough um, you guys will see it next month debt debt gets nothing and miscellaneous gets nothing as well so that being said let's uh, move on to our savings binder okay so my savings slash savings challenges. Um, there are quite a few new things. I um, So I purchased some challenges from Arlie. Uh, she um, gave me a Christmas freebie and this is gonna go towards my gifts envelope which is actually in this container right here but I just wanted to show it off before I forget. And then road trip as well. Um, I will save $60. For the Christmas one, it's $175, which is plenty. Um, but this is from early as well. And I have a travel envelope in that container. And then the weight loss one, um, that is also in that container. But like I said, I just wanted to introduce it at the same time as my other challenges. But as you can see, I will be stuffing $3 because I lost weight. <laughs> but okay, let's move on. So for this one, this one is our 1K challenge and that gets $10. And so 10, 20, and 30 out of 1,000, 30% of the way there. No, 3%. <laughs> Um, next is 
free 50 challenge and that is $20. And let's see how much we have in here so far. 20, 40, 5, 45 dollars. Um, my scratch offs will be also linked down below. Okay, the 100 envelope challenge. Um, I will be doing a $30 and $3. Um, it's pretty skimp this week, but it is what it is. 30 Another random envelope. And then next is three dollars one two three uh oh I already messed up I think one two three I think fitness so I did this budgeting before I um stepped on the scale this morning so in total I lost three but I think I based it off of my um previous weight, which was two pounds ago, I guess, instead of the three. Okay, so, oops, I'll just have to find a dollar somewhere, I think. Okay, so, that's done. Okay, um, next is the Lucky Cat Challenge, and the Lucky Cat gets $20. There's 20, 40, 50. Oh, this is a fake hundred that isn't included in the challenge. She just gave me a freebie, so I kept it in here. Okay, next is, this is the $100 challenge, and that gets, did I not write it down? Oh no. I hope I didn't mess up. So I'm pretty sure this gets $10. <laughs> 10, 20, 30. Okay, and then the $200 gets $30. Hmm, I have a feeling this isn't going to work out. 20, 40. 50, 5, 65, 65 dollars, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, $70, uh oh, see, I'm getting flustered, starting to mess up again, okay, so, next is, oh, this is, I'm saving that until I finish these other challenges, so, next up is, our sinking funds and let's see how it goes that's making me nervous okay here we go let's see if I messed up <laughs> okay so YouTube YouTube does not get anything electronics gets five dollars so in total there is twenty five dollars The car does not get anything. My niece gets five dollars. Oops. So in total she has ten. Fitness gets the two dollars. So in total there's three dollars in here. Uh, that kind of makes up for not having that extra dollar. That dollar was like from a month ago and I restarted again. So we'll call that even. Um, gifts gets $5. So there's 20, 30, 40, 5, 50, 1, 2, 57 dollars. A chunk of change now. Okay, so books doesn't get anything. Hello 30 does not get anything. Clothes gets five dollars. Ah, that's the last one. So it's five dollars here. So 
so I think I messed up and allocated this was supposed to get five dollars and makeup was also supposed to get five dollars so it is what it is I'd rather put it into my savings challenges and these sinking funds because these aren't that important to me um, but yeah back to being hot mess expressed <laughs> Um, if you made it this far, thank you for watching and I will see you guys next time. Um, it might be a vlog about work or it might be a budgeting video. We'll see. Um, in the meantime, I hope you guys have a great day. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.